Hello guys, another video from my car as every Saturday and today let's talk about hype. Some technologies, some tech stacks, some frameworks or languages may become popular in your circle. For example, if on Twitter you follow a lot of Laravel people, it would seem that tall stack and Livewire is very popular. Also, same topic, GraphQL is pretty popular in the last years and I even have courses on both GraphQL and Livewire on my Teachable.com account. But recently, while doing a review of Laravel jobs for senior positions, I've noticed that over 50 jobs, only a few times they mentioned Livewire or GraphQL. So what I wanna say by that is general in grand schema of job market, you should trust the trusted technologies first, the technologies and tech stack that are existing for longer, more trusted by the community, by bigger organizations, with a lot of projects, documentation, track record, and all of that. So basically, new technology is not necessarily the best to learn to get jobs. That said, it depends on what market are you in. And for example, the same Livewire or GraphQL may be cool if you are a solid developer for a project and you are in charge of what to use to deliver. And with those technologies, you would deliver faster or more conveniently. But sometimes I see developers making decisions what to learn based on the hype in their circle of social network. So it seems to them that everyone needs to learn Livewire or Alpine or GraphQL or Flutter or whatever is the next big thing, which changes almost every month. And that is not the case. As I said, you should trust the proven and older and more stable technologies like Laravel became, but it became like that almost in five years or so. So it gained more and more trust from the community and from bigger companies as well. So it takes time for the market adoption. That said, if we take another point of view from the opposite direction, you don't need to satisfy all the market. If you decided to become a specialist with one technology, like Livewire or GraphQL, for example, maybe you would be lucky to find one job and one job is totally enough, that would require deeper knowledge in that technology, which you would be a professional of. So that could be also your choice. You're kind of creating a job for yourself, narrowing the market, narrowing the chances of getting the job, but the job would be a perfect fit for you. If you can find something like this, maybe it's a better solution. So these are my random thoughts, kind of contradicting with each other sometimes, but my main thought is do not run after the hype, just because you've seen 100 tweets about some technology. Make the research, make the notes about the job ads or projects that you're aiming for in the future, and only then start learning and start adopting new technologies. This is my advice for today. That's it for now, and see you guys in other videos.